Hey guys, how's it going and welcome back to a brand new video on the channel. Now today we are reacting to another clip from Would I Lie To You and this one is Debbie McGee's Bikini Alarm. So I don't know what to expect from this, this was recommended to me by Jack Carter and you've recommended me some great ones in the past so I'm sure this one will be as well. I'm just very confused by the title, considering it is Debbie McGee. But I don't know, that's the thing with Would I Lie To You. You hear the craziest stories and you can pretty much expect anything and you don't know whether it's true or false, really. The most unlikely things can be true and the most things that you think, yep, yeah, that's true, are false. You never know when it comes to Would I Lie To You. But yeah, guys, I'm looking forward to getting into this one. If you guys do enjoy this video, make sure to like and subscribe. And without further ado, let's get into the reaction. And here we the go, police guys. police once surrounded my house after I set off an alarm in my bikini bottoms. <laughs> okay. Interesting. Uh, interesting location for the alarm. <laughs> What's, what was the alarm that you set off and how the did you set it? It was the house alarms. I was actually ironing in the garden with my bikini on. Right. And I had the remote control for the alarms tucked down my bikini. Let me, let me stop you there. <laughs> I could have sworn you said you were ironing in the garden. Yeah, the that's yeah. the most unlikely it's a bit. classic domestic scene. <laughs> I love that commitment to ironing. I haven't ironed anything since the late 90s. But, <laughs> <laughs> she's just, yeah. <laughs> but Debbie's just knocking one out in the garden. Uh, oh, quite a few years ago now. And in your bikini bottoms was the remote control yeah. for what? That set off the house alarms. For, for the burglar alarm? Yes, so I don't know what you call them. A but panic button. Be like a panic button. Right. I think if I was in the garden in, in a bikini ironing, I'd feel very vulnerable because there's a lot of flesh, <laughs> isn't there, in the iron? You know how easy in the phone Yeah, rings that's a fair point. <laughs> Did you not to be feel... honest, if you're going to smash the iron into your head, it doesn't matter. <laughs> 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 the bikini or the uniform or the Chelsea pensioners. Very true, very true. Very true. So, what happened when you pressed the alarm? Who was alerted and what, had, what did right, they do? Right, so I didn't know because it doesn't set the alarms off. It just rings the police. And so 15 policemen came round the corner. They shouted, no, start yeah. with the collar, then the sleeve. <laughs> <laughs> I never tried it again, so I don't know. How did they react? Did they see the funny side? Um, yes. No, she wasn't facing them. <laughs> <laughs> nice, nice. Nice. <laughs> Little bit uncalled for, but nice. <laughs> I, I know that's rude, but I can't quite figure out why. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay, well, I mean, it's elaborate, it's odd, it's unusual. Is it true? Right. In my... Let's think about this then. Um, I... This has been a short one. There's not really much to go off. I'm just going to try and break down the actual parts of the story. Would you do iron in in the garden? I I don't know why you would. I've never heard of those things that set off the alarm. I thought the alarms were set off on motion. When someone comes into the house, it sets off the alarm. I didn't know you had like a panic button which you could press and it would cause the police to come. Maybe Debbie McGee is a celebrity. Maybe she has a whole different set of alarms. I don't know. That, and that's pretty much all there is. And then she said 15 police came. I, oh, guys, I don't actually know. I, I don't think this is true. I think this is false. It's the sort of thing that would be true. But I don't think you're dying in the garden for one. I don't think uh, the 15 police would come for two. And I just don't get this alarm system. There's not much to go off. The best part of this was probably Bob Mortimer's joke. <laughs> but I'm going to say it's false. And that's, it could be true, but I'm going to say it's false. Let's see what it is. Younger days as a sun worshipper, I would do anything outdoors. Mm -hmm. When you're young and you want a tan, you just do anything. What, what do you think? Nothing. <laughs> <laughs> <Wow>. No. I... <laughs> You know you had to make quicker decisions on the football pitch. <laughs> <laughs> I think that's true. Yeah? You think it's true? I think you think it's true? We think, we, we think it's true. Sure. We think it's true. Debbie, truth or lie? 
Well, you, you got me. You got you got me, Debbie. <laughs> and that's it, guys. Wow, like it's it's one of the weird stories, which it's it seems false, but it's true. There's there's pretty much nothing else to it. I I've just never known anyone to do the ironing in the garden. I've never known an alarm to work off a button which you control. And I've never known such a heavy police response to this. But no, fair enough, Debbie, if that's what you like to do, feel free for it. And the story was true, so I guess that is what you like to do, but yeah. Thank you very much, Jack, for the recommendation once again. Always giving me great recommendations. If you guys have any recommendations, let me know in the comments section. And yeah, I will see you guys in the next video tomorrow, which will be a Taskmaster. Okay.